Yeah? All right. All right, everyone. Welcome to my movie review on Alone. So Alone is a movie that went to theaters and drive-ins. Um, Alone is a movie... No, I meant to say the drive-in theaters and on demand. I mean, probably not movie indoor theater. Indoor theaters. Uh, it's just probably drive-ins and on demand. So, so Alone is a movie about this girl named uh, Jessie, I believe. Somehow goes like on a vacation meeting or something. And, uh, but somehow she was like moving to like the countryside and oh... I forgot the state's name. It's something with O, but comment down below if I forgot what was the state name. I think it was like Omega or something. But somehow this man was somehow having a little bit of like a car problem issue when he, he had like a broken arm. But before that, he was somehow texting like someone and then like he was in the way, but then like like, he was, like, saying he was texting, but then he didn't look, and he was also in a rush. But then his car got broke down, and then, like, somehow the man has been actually been following her for the first half of the film. Then, like, somewhere at the end, you know, somewhere at the first couple of scenes, she gets kidnapped, escapes, and, uh, tries to survive in the wilderness. Like, that's literally how the thing is. So, I gotta tell you this. The second act, like, in one scene, actually has a very big twist into the film like this film actually has a little bit of a twist and a couple of scenes by the first act is kind of like russell crowe's unhinged but it's on the countryside like you know how russell crowe's unhinged film was like in the city with that it's like that but it's on the countryside but it's a little bit it's just a little bit and uh and it's kind of very well shot with the cinematography like with like something more with like this way of like a TV movie like that's really what these movies are called like when alone goes to theaters and on demand like something with studios that I don't know who they are something with it but uh in this film is actually very very brutal it's very brutal like, imagine, like, with her escaping, and she's, like, surviving in the wilderness. Imagine it's, like, Rambo Last Blood or something. No, 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 not Last Blood. First Blood. Rambo First Blood. When he was, like, somehow wanted by cops, and he uses the wilderness to to survive. And, uh, it's got good screenplay into it, and that the whole, like, color scenes in there, with like, when it, like, shows the daytime, it's actually very well lit. It's, like, very good colored. Like, it's probably not green screen or something. Like, some movies don't do green screen. They, like, actually go to the States or something. Like, something like that. And, uh, the lady's character, Jessie, I think, she was alright. And this man who is somehow kidnaps her. I don't want to spoil the twist, like I know I told you before. So, that's really going to be that. Uh, here's what I got to say of Alone. It's brutal, not scary, and uh, very well shot. Uh, kind of gory, but probably the same thing as brutal. And okay characters, no music and no score. And I kind of wanted a good ending if she went to like a hospital or something. Like there is like nothing with the ending. Like, all it is is she... I don't want to tell you the ending. But, that is all I got. Um, Alone is just... I'm going to give Alone a 9 out of 10 and an A. So, that is all I got. See you later for Ringtober. Because Ringtober is here, ladies and gentlemen. Ringtober is finally here. Alright, see ya. Bye-bye.